Hello and good morning to all. We're here at Edgbiston. I'm Adam Gilchrist and alongside me today is Michael Atherton, Mel Jones and the one and only Ali Mitchell. Thanks for the fabulous introduction. We're just about ready to get underway. Thanks, Alison. It looks like the captains are ready for the toss. Let's go pitch side. The pitch seems to suit it. Good call to bowl first. It certainly looks like there'll be something early on for the bowlers. The openers will really need to keep things tight in the early overs. So here we go. The players make their way out to a seismic crowd. They've waited all day for this match and they're ready for some world-class batting and bowling. The pitch today, that looks good. A bit of grass on top, so they'll get their wish, I think. We're about to get underway and already the crowd is up and about. This is looking to be a great day of cricket. Can't get that outside the ring field. Bonus runs here, four of them. The field are probably thinking of keeping the batters honest, but it's only succeeded in frustrating the bowler. Might look to go big again here. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Couldn't get it through the field. Beats the field with a great shot. That showed great skill. Lovely timing. The boundary was the only place that ball was heading. Boundary last ball. What's to come this delivery? I wonder. Finds the edge. End of the over. Eight runs coming from it. The Brave are eight for none. Good over for the batters to start the innings. Wong from the city end. Does very well to quickly get across to this one. Magical shot into the vacant fine leg position. I do not think anyone's going to stop that. You can't hit the ball much better than that. Timed it to perfection. Do they go full? Do they go short? A lot to ponder this delivery after the boundary. Doesn't beat the infield. Nicked it. End of the over. Four runs coming off it. The Brave, a 12 for none. Excellent first over, and they followed up with a solid second over of the power play. The new batter always likes to feel bad on ball as they bring a bit of nervous energy to the wicket. The right arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the pavilion end. Perfectly timed. Well, what a lovely shot. It flew to the boundary. 
That's clearly not the type of delivery to be bowling here. Yeah, it can be very disheartening seeing good delivery smacked around. Sometimes, though, you've just got to accept it and move on. Threaded it through brilliantly. All timing on that shot. Back-to-back -back boundaries. Can they make it three in a row? Really put the bowler on the back foot. Finds the fielder with that shot. Drilled that one away. Just sheer power off the back foot. Don't need to worry about running. Wyatt has gotten the big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. Edged it. End of the over and a very nicely bowled one. Not much opportunity score runs there. They're continuing to go for it and it's paying off. Excellent power play so far. The right arm medium bowler is coming into the attack from the pavilion end. Massive outside edge. Nicely fielded out deep on the boundary. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on a length is obviously the way to go. Oh boy, that's a maximum. I want to know how far that's gone. Came right off the meat of the bat. Hit that one on the up. A fabulous drive for six. Perry shouldn't be too worried about that last ball. They've got them playing their shots. Just need to tighten their areas now. Square cut, finds point, no run. That's the over. The Brave, 33 for none. That's the end of the power play. Southern Brave are now 33 for none. Divine from the city end. Huge edge. Threw the hands at it, got it early, but enough on it to get four. A uh, good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Unplayable. Gone. Great catch. Quick reactions. Oh, wow. Brilliant reactions and what a catch. The first wicket gone. The opening partnership is broken. You can see the relief on the bowler's face. Another quick wicket and they'll be into the middle order. With the fall of that wicket, the new batter comes charging out to the crease. They're quick to take guard and face up. Nicked it. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Edged. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. It was quick onto that in the infield. Four runs out of there. 
The Brave are 37 for one. These two enjoy batting together and it shows. They've used the pace off the ball and bludgeoned it when needed. Onto that early, that could be four. You just can't hit it any better than that. Drilled it. No chance there for the fielders. I'd like to see them just aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. Good bowling. Kept it nice and tight and made it hard to score. End of the Perry, the pace bowler, coming into the attack. Elise Perry, the new bowler, into the attack. That was a lovely punch down the ground. It's in the gap, and there should be a few on offer here. Maybe three. Glanced away nicely, but fine short, fine leg. Well, that just shows how difficult life can be as a bowler. Lifts the ball off a good length. A fabulous bit of timing for six. Can she come back with a dot ball? Great shot. Pulled straight to backward square leg, though. End of the over. Ten runs from it. The Brave, a 54 for one. End of the eighth over. The right armour is coming into the attack from the pavilion end. The new bowler into the attack for Birmingham Phoenix. Oh, that's been heaved away and punished over the rope. That's a brute of a maximum. Well, that was a big hit. Incredible power, just incredible. Nothing wrong with the delivery, but still it goes for six. Perry, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Unplayable. Just got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Crap. Head was completely still, and they struck that hard, high, and long for six. Just missed the line. Not the worst delivery, but that was dispatched with interest. Everyone just watched that in awe.
getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot. Cuts that off well in the infield. That's going a long way. What a shot. Well, that was just textbook. Finds the space and power to lift that ball over the top, and it just keeps going. Playing all their shots in that over, a very expensive over. Well, they've just kept going, haven't they? If a wicket falls now, the rest of the batters can probably come in with a really aggressive mindset. A little bit of wobble on that one, and it's safely taken by the keeper. Not enough on it to entice a shot. Edge, but it drops safely. Flex that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Perfect, right out of the middle and bludgeons that one to the boundary. That was a brilliant boundary, really well timed and now starting to score quickly. End of the over, six off it. The Brave, a 78 for one. The bowler will continue for the next five balls. Mark Sood from the city end. Edged. Magical shot into the vacant fine leg position, and I do not think anyone's going to stop that. Four runs. They were so still at the crease. Just a slight movement forward. Fabulous shot. Strays onto the leg and glanced it nicely. Might just get to the boundary rope. Erz on the side of bowling slightly fuller, and they've been put away. Arla back into the attack. Now, seven, two, one. Emily Arland, the new bowler into the attack.
Can't get that outside the ring field. Finds the edge. Bouchier, stand and deliver. Holds the pose as the ball goes straight over the bowler. Six more. Well, that's what you pay your entrance money for. It's flown into the crowd. A brilliant shot off the front foot. No need to move. Six runs out of there. The Brave, and 93 for one. Kept the heat on throughout this inning so far. Really good batting. The next few overs could tell the tale of just how big this score will be. Devine coming back into the attack. Nicked it. That's gone for six. That is a huge one. Bouchier, it's plenty from these bowlers. Crunch on the front foot and bang. Gone all the way. Tried something a bit different last delivery and the captain shouldn't mind that too much. If they get it right, they just might get that wicket. Massive outside edge. Flashed at it. Didn't time it well, but got enough to get it to the boundary. Super batting at the moment. Back-to-back -back boundaries, putting the pressure right on the bowler. They've got to respond. Driven on the onside, but straight to mid-wicket. Beats the field with a great shot. Wow, power off the front foot, goes all the way. End of the over, a big one, 16 runs coming from it. The Brave are 109 for one. Going with pace now. Nine for one, Tess Flintoff, the new bowler into the attack. Glanced away nicely, but fine short, fine leg. Can she get the 50? Couldn't get it through the field. One to get for 50. On 49, a quick single maybe. Straight to the fielder. End of the over, just one off it. The Brave, 110 for one. They had a great foundation early on and they've carried it forward to make a big total. Oh my, my, that's just flown off the middle. Threaded it through brilliantly, all timing on that shot. A good innings, that's 50, a simple raise of the bats. Thumbs up to their batting partner and they're ready to go again. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder.
Out. No. Somehow it's missed everything. Caught. It's one of the easiest catches you'll see. Oh, wow. Brilliant reactions and what a catch. Two down, the long walk back to the pavilion for them. This could be a huge swing of momentum. New batter comes to the crease. Never an easy time to come into bat after the fall of a wicket. Wow, that's missed a lot. Good bowling. Kept it nice and tight and made it hard to score. Been some really good overs strung together. They've taken some risks along with some good running. A very good total is on the way. Whipped off the legs and away goes the ball. Finally, no chance and a great catch in the crowd. It's flown into the crowd. To get that much power coming forward on the front foot is ridiculous. Gone aerial with that one. It'll land safe. Might not be four. That just drifted a bit and pounced on. Hit high and mighty. They'll be really happy with that. Top class innings, been playing very nicely out there and brings up the half century. Onto that early, that could be four. No, no, no. Terrible shot. Everyone's gone up. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. And with that wicket, we'll see a change out in the middle. The task here will be that of support and getting themselves settled into their innings. Mark Sood finishes an economical over and walks away with a wicket, which was fully deserved. Levick Binner coming into the attack. That's high. Is there enough on it? There is. Add that maximum to the scoreboard. Thank you very much. Barely seemed to hit that. Brilliant shot. It's got it up and over all the way for six. Power and precision in that shot. Well, he can't fault that shot. It's nicely played, and it was four runs all the way. Boundary last delivery. Is that the sign they're trying to push the run rate? They've gone up here. Across the stumps and a flick of the wrist. It's wide square leg. Could be four. Quickly into position and a very successful sweep brought that boundary. How will she reply? Oh, I thought that was passing, but a fantastic dive to cut it off. Well, that was a struggle, getting smacked all over the park. Levick from the city end.
That's a big one, a maximum, away she goes. If you lose the pictures, it's because it's hit the broadcast truck. Well, enough leverage there to get a good swing of the arms under it to get it over the rope. How will the bowler respond? Nice shot, just a flick off the pads. the fielder with that shot. Drilled that one away. Needs to be on target. Great shot, through the gap. You can't hit the ball much better than that. Timed it to perfection. 14 runs out of there. The Brave, 156 for three. They had a great foundation early on, and they've carried it forward to make a big total. Perry coming on, obviously hoping the pace will cause some trouble. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Beats the outside edge. Good bowling there. Misses everything. That's the end of the over. Two runs added. The Brave, 158 for three. They attacked all areas of the ground, fours, sixes, and there was strong running as well. Devine has the ball in hand. The captain will be hoping they can tie one end down. Runs have been flowing a little too easily. Massive outside edge. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on a length is obviously the way to go.
still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. Huge shot. That's a massive shot. Just incredible. This batter is brilliant off the back foot. Transfers their weight back and pulls it away for a maximum. Perry to finish this innings. Elise Perry, the new bowler into the attack for Birmingham Phoenix. Edge, but it drops safely. Just got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Brilliant shot. That's one for the crowd. Hit that one on the up. A fabulous drive for six. Just need to keep it simple. Line and length. Around about off stump. That'll force a mistake. Thick edge. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Big edge. End of the 20th over. Southern Brave are now on the end of the five for three. The bowlers have leaked way too many easy runs in that innings. It's a big total to chase down. They're going to need some good batting partnerships. I reckon this is a respectable total. If the bowlers can get firing and get some early wickets, this will be a difficult chase. Here we go. Coming in for the first ball.
A lot of pressure on the trees. Not had the best of weeks leading up to this game, so I want to show everyone their strength. Doesn't beat the infield. Edged. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Massive edge. Misses everyone, and that's racing away. Five runs added in the over. The Phoenix are five for none. End of the first over. Brown, the right armour is coming into the attack from the city end. Gone! Played all around that one. What a delivery. What a crucial breakthrough this is. Excellent bowling to get one of the key wickets cheaply. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. Power and precision in that shot. It didn't time that at all, but managed to get it away to the boundary. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot. Finds the edge. Edged it. Lovely cover drive, straight to the extra cover fielder. End of the over, four off it. The Phoenix, a nine for one. They just dropped off a bit that second over. Need to maintain the intensity. Brown from the pavilion end. Drilled that one away. That was a boundary the moment the ball left the bat. Can't time that any better. Perfection. Can't afford to go too full again. It does help to switch up your deliveries just to keep them guessing. Drive straight down the ground. Mid on will collect that one though. It was timed well for four. Gee, that was a good shot. Super batting at the moment. Back-to-back -back boundaries, putting the pressure right on the bowler. They've got to respond. That's a confident appeal. The Brave having a good chat with the captain. Not sure this one is worth a review, though. Was there an edge? This could be trouble. I'm not hearing anything on this. That could be trouble. Well, they lose the second wicket. It's a long way back to the sheds. And you can tell they're not happy with that dismissal. And with that wicket, the new batter will mark centre. Just needs to rotate the strike early on as they get settled into their innings.
Can't get that outside the ring field. Really good over. Takes a wicket and keeps it tight. Somehow they've got to find some boundaries. Smacks that away through the gap. Big edge. Nicked it. Onto the front foot, super shot, should be four. Threw the hands at it, got it early, but enough on it to get four. I'd like to see them just aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Over the infield with a cracking shot. That showed great skill, lovely timing. The boundary was the only place that ball was heading. Well, that was another good over. You can see the frustration growing on the batters. Shrub Sol, back on now. The new bowler into the attack. Couldn't get it through the field. Power and precision in that shot. A poor delivery, and you don't pass up chances like that. Crushed away for four. Can she come back with a dot ball? Was quick onto that in the infield. Five runs added in the over. The Phoenix, 32 for two. End of the sixth over. Going with spin now. Now to put it. Kelly Moore, the new bowler, into the attack for Southern Brave. Glanced away nicely, but fine short, fine leg. Finds the fielder with that shot. Massive outside edge. Beats the field with a great shot. It's flown into the crowd to get that much power coming forward on the front foot is ridiculous. End of the over. Nine off it. The Phoenix, a 41 for two. Now on 41 for two.
Bell, the right arm medium bowler is coming into the attack from the pavilion end. Cuts that off well in the infield. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Six of your finest, please. Cover drive for a maximum. Brilliant. Hit that so hard. Pressed forward, got the body shape right and launched it. One for the textbook. Last one helped the scoring rate, making their intentions for this innings. Wax the free hit away. The fielder coming around to cut it off, perhaps. Flex that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Got that away nicely. End of the over. Eight off it. The Phoenix, 49 for two. They've got busy working the ball around and hitting boundaries in between. It's a good setup for a strong finish. Kemp from the pavilion end. Maximum. Well, enough leverage there to get a good swing of the arms under it to get it over the rope. Shrub Soul, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Bowler, straight through, good swing coming back in. Well, the end of a productive innings. It didn't quite ignite into fireworks as we would have hoped, but still solid work. The field will come up now, you'd think. Pressure should be on as the new batter strides to the middle. They'll be looking for another quick wicket. Straight to the fielder. Seven runs out of there. The Phoenix, a 56 for three. Driven on the onside, but straight to mid wicket. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitching it on a length is obviously the way to go. No, no, no. Terrible shot. Thank you. 
Square cut, finds point, no run. Brown has finished off a tidy over there. Nothing to show for it, but will be well pleased nevertheless. Now This bowler knows how to give the ball an almighty tweak. Let's see how they go. Good catch out. Simple as you like, the batter didn't bother to look at more than one delivery in that over. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. Now, yeah, great opportunity to prove the critics wrong. Certainly needs to build an innings for the team. Just opened the face of the bat really well. That's through the infield. And there'll be four more. Well, that one's for the textbook. Stands tall on top of the bounce and a lovely flick of the wrist at the end. How will she reply? Two straight. It's just been helped on its way for a maximum. Fine shot there. That's just a brilliantly aggressive shot. Gets onto the front foot and it's flown over the boundary. Just missed the line. Not the worst delivery, but that was dispatched with interest. Everyone just watched that in awe. Yeah, nice early call. That's an easy run. Wide of extra cover and away goes the ball to the boundary. That was a lovely flowing drive through the covers to pick up the four. Really good over, takes a wicket and keeps it tight. Somehow they've got to find some boundaries. Try on from the pavilion end. Need five runs and have four out. Oh, nice catch, great reactions. Oh, great work, held their nerve while the ball was in the air, and they've taken a good catch. Well, this is a fantastic wicket. Kept the runs down, really didn't get settled, and looked to be in trouble for most of the knock. That's well, a long way to walk out there, just to turn around and walk straight back. They'll just want to get this first run behind them, and then push on. And out, two wickets, two balls. There'd be a bit of tension in the batter's pavilion right now. End again. See you later on your bike. Two wickets on the trot. Really getting to the tail enders now. Sixth wicket gone. There's not a lot left in this lineup. Patrick Ball. What kind of delivery will we see? The bat will be looking to just make it through this ball. Nice shot, but straight to gully. Over the Phoenix, a 71 for six. End of the 12th over. Birmingham Phoenix are now on. So one kisses.
finds the edge. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Oh, that's beautifully struck right out of the guts and all the way. That's what you pay the entrance money for. It's flown into the crowd. A brilliant shot off the front foot. No need to move. That's the end of a very good over. Great pressure being placed on the batters here. Moore into the attack now from the city end. Yeah, they've held that. Brilliant work in the deep. Simple as you like. The batter didn't bother to look at more than one delivery in that over. They find themselves seven wickets down. It's about now you need someone to stand up and stick around at the crease. A difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to settle themselves in before facing their first ball. Doesn't beat the infield. Still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. Oh, the batter's made a bit of a meal of that delivery. Bowling fielders look really confident. It's the end of the over. One run coming from it. The Phoenix are 81 for seven. End of the 13th over. Birmingham Phoenix are now in one for seven. Bell coming back on here. They've been bowling really well so far. Can't get that outside the ring field. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. Nicely fielded out deep on the boundary. Edged over the Phoenix. Around three for seven. Moore coming back into the attack has done well so far. The new bowler into the attack for Southern Brave. And what a strike that is, right into the slot. Great timing and balance. It'll be a maximum. Went downtown and did it very well. Great shot, pulled straight to backward square leg goal. Got it away brilliantly. 
Just a flick of the wrist at the very end. Getting nice and settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot. Too good. That is huge. That ball's been hit. It's flown into the crowd. To get that much power coming forward onto the front foot is ridiculous. A very professional innings, this. Passes 50. I'll certainly be looking to push on. Slips have really gone up here. They like it. The Brave having a good chat with the captain. Not sure this one is worth a review, though. I'm not hearing anything on this. That could be trouble. Was there an edge? This could be trouble. Yeah, great decision by the umpire. Challenge wasn't successful. Phoenix need six runs and have seven out. for this bowler. Bell from the pavilion end. Good shot. A beauty. Showed good composure to wait on that slower ball and find room to get the four runs. Just a fantastic shot. Might look to go big again here. Nearly gets the edge. Bell with a great delivery there. Still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. Give that much width and you are asking for trouble. That was so well timed, it flew over the boundary. How will the bowler respond? Massive outside edge. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Beats the outside edge. Good bowling there. End of the over. A big one. 11 runs coming from it. The Phoenix, 111 for seven. The batters have controlled the middle portion of this innings, but they'll need to launch now with wickets in the dugout. The right armour is coming on to bowl from the city end. Somehow it's missed everything. It's a full toss and worked off the pads nicely, but well before. That is a masterclass of batting. Reads the length, gets forward, dispatches it to the boundary. Oh. 
misses everything. That's a solid shot. And gone. Brilliant catch. In the air, and cover takes an easy catch. The eighth wicket to fall. The opening batters out there in the field will probably be starting to prepare themselves for their own innings. Yeah, big opportunity. They've worked really hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build an innings and get a big score on the board. Tryon has been going really well here. Comes back on from the city end. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Great shot. It was a good length to try that, and they did that with maximum results. Six more. Well, enough leverage there to get a good swing of the arms under it to get it over the rope. Shrub Soul, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Oh, my word, that is huge. Middle, that's a monster of a shot. Well, that's a waste of a delivery. Absolutely no trouble getting onto it and dispatching it for six. Perry has gotten the big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. Square cut, finds point, no run. A great over, and a good chance that's finally swung the match in their favour. It's a long way back now for the batters. They're behind the required rate late in the innings. No other choice now but to just go for it. Shrub Soul coming into the attack from the pavilion end. Huge edge. Just got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Doesn't even wait to see if the ball's going to do anything. Onto the front foot, punches it away to the boundary. Don't always mind getting hit for runs. What's important, just focus on getting the next delivery right. Massive outside edge. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on length is obviously the way to go. Perfectly timed. Threaded it through brilliantly. All timing on that shot. Now, good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Edged unplayable. End of the over. Nine runs coming from it. The Phoenix, 138 for eight. There was some wonderful stroke play on offer for the fans here. Bowlers just weren't tight enough. That's a big one, a maximum. Away she goes. If you lose the pictures, it's because it's hit the broadcast truck. That's just a brilliantly aggressive shot. Gets onto the front foot and it's flown over the boundary. Thick edge.
Have to go for it now. Edged it. They really need a boundary, this ball. Good fielding out in the boundary. That's the match. It looked like too many runs were needed in that final over, and so it has proved to be. Great bowling, brilliant win. That's all from us in the commentary box. It's been an amazing match. Hope to see you again soon.